Speaking of some big moments on the diamond, we had a few of them to go around this last week here in Central Georgia. Let's fire up our top plays of the week. A couple Central Georgia teams looking to make it a May to remember before the baseball season comes to a close. The Mercer Bears battling the Citadel in Game 2 of the SoCon Tournament. Josh Farmer went out with a bang. Nine full innings, six hits, one run, and five, count them, five strikeouts to show for it. Here's a few of them. His last collegiate start, one for the books, as Mercer advanced with an 8-1 win over the Bulldogs. Then it was on to UNC Greensboro. Later Friday night, Bears backs against the wall. Not if Ty Daly has something to say about it. Get in the car. We're going to Denny's. It's Grand Slam time for the preseason conference freshman of the year. That right there would put Mercer in front 4-3, to three, but it would not be enough against the Spartans. Mercer's season comes to a close in Game 3 of the SOCOM Tournament. More playoff action on the high school side now. A little rain isn't going to scare away the John Millage Academy Trojans. Going for the sweep against Pinewood Christian. Blake Bellflower, you can kiss that one goodbye. Two-run job for BB, and that is the difference for the Trojans in the state championship. Who's going back-to-back? -back? The Trojans are going back-to-back. -back. Congratulations to Coach Starley and his group on another great year. And those are your top plays of the week. All right, exciting times for sure. That does it for now in sports. Taylor, what's going on over there?